Just like other six-year-olds, Duncan Ackert should be gearing up for grade one, but instead he is at the BC Children's Hospital undergoing treatment for leukemia. This is the only place that treats kids with cancer at this stage that he's in. Duncan and his family will be staying at the Ronald McDonald House in Vancouver for months, far from their home in Williams Lake. But a new program through the charity is helping the young boy continue his education, making up for lost time at school. They have one-on-one -on -one sessions, which Duncan loves because he loves to learn. And we are expected to be here for a good chunk of time without getting to go back home. So that will be really nice okay. that they can do school here during that time as well. The education program provides hands-on learning support and resources for children fighting serious illnesses. Sarah Shinkarik is one of the teachers. Sarah comes in uh, at least a couple of times a week and uh, teaches either individual kids depending on the age or a group depending on if uh, we have kids that are, are in that same uh, target uh, learning area. He says Ronald McDonald House BC supports more than 70 families at a time, each child with their own unique needs. Duncan and his sister Shelley take part in the program together. A lot of times uh, if there's a, um, uh, a disinfectant protocol, then uh, it would need to be a one-on-one -on -one situation. Uh, we do certainly have the sick kids and the siblings that are in the program. Ronald McDonald House says one year of the education program costs about $45,000 which will have to come from donations. It keeps kids connected to what they should be doing, which is learning and growing as individuals and uh, that normalcy that they would have if they were in their home neighborhood. The Eckert family says the new program has been beneficial for their son, who just wants to be a kid. Saurabh Sandhu, CBC News, Vancouver.